Boris Canto is really just a small timer, but he sure pissed off some wealthy people. This should be easy. Let's meet up at Robeline and corner the guy. Hit it. After you. So, an easy mark. Destination Just reached. what I needed. A gaggle of shitheads. Craft intro. There he is. Mars Canto, you ready to come quiet or do we gotta rally you around in that can? Missile inbound. Screw you, little girl. Well, that's not very nice. Damn, he's getting away. Follow him. You just try and shake me, buddy. Where did you go? Destination Time reached. to get into it. Looks like I found you. Resources God detected. Come, oh, Fred, little one. This will all be over soon. Hostile craft inbound. Missile inbound. Your end awaits you. You know, let's meet up back at Lafitte and then, well, I'm a girl of her word.
Juno, I sure appreciated the company. It was kind of like getting to work and visit my folks at the same time. Pay up. You were going to give me some information I needed. First, what's your interest in Ruth? I kind of like the guy, and I'd hate to send a hired gun his way. We've got some unsettled business. He got the jump on me last time, but I don't plan to let it happen again. If he got the jump on you and you're still around to talk about it, he already went easy on you. Yeah, maybe. Neither one of us got out of it clean, though. I guess all I'm saying is maybe you want to try a different approach. Ruth's a solid guy. Anyway, I'm a girl of my word and he's hanging around Tulula. Give him my regards. And if that arthritis ever flares up and you need some youthful energy, well, you know where to find me. Destination reached. Something smoky. Old barrel number seven. Whiskey crafted the traditional way from cold pressed proof max appendages and fermented in a damp tunnel. Clearance granted. You are now entering an automatic landing zone. Seven distilleries. Rutlo Valkiza, Volochan Mool. If you can't speak. Ruth, I made a promise I'd try to come at this from a different angle this time. Perhaps we could make it through this exchange without you shooting me in the head. Do you think that might be a possibility? Do I need you to empty out your boots? You stay on your side of the table, and we'll be fine. Yes, well, I suppose that will have to do. I understand you believe I've wronged you, but I assure you that is not the case. I had it on pretty good authority that you were the one who killed my husband. That seems like a pretty significant wrong. If you think the Catholic counts as pretty good authority, then that doesn't say much for you as a judge of character. I've met your husband before, and while I wouldn't classify Brace as a good man, he certainly didn't need killing. I've got a balance to keep, and murdering your husband would have put me too deep in the hole. What's with those rings, anyway? These are my moral abacus, I guess you'd say. I'm no saint, but I like to keep things equalized. Some noble jobs to even out the dirty ones. A ring for every one. That seems like a pretty screwed up moral code. This from the woman who put a dent in my skull. All right, that's fair. So you say you didn't do it. I'm not sure why I should believe you. I didn't follow you down to the surface of Lubbock and ionize you. Maybe that's a mark in my favor. I'm suggesting that you consider the provenance of your information. The Catholic is tarnishing my good name. And maybe I've got something to say about that. In fact, I'll do you one better. I'll join you in shaking the truth out of him. Sharky vouches for you, so let's say I take you at your word. We still gotta find the guy. I may have an angle on that. I've got an in with the Louisiana police force. I'll check and see if there's any related activity registered. Why don't you take in the local sites, and I'll let you know what comes up. I have a feeling I'm gonna regret this. It took me a hell of a long time to track you back down. 
Ms. Markov, what has a man got but his word? A gun, for starters. You can depend on both of mine. Pull up a chair. What can I do for you? What do you say? Anything happening I should know about? There was a rumor going around about something stashed out of the way. They did let slip the coordinates. Maybe worth a look? Thanks. Thanks for the drink. Stop back in next time you're in the area. girl. Now that things have settled down over at the den, we're back to our more routine sort of problems. You got some time to lend a hand? For you, Marla? Yeah, I can swing that. Thanks, Juno. See you soon. Destination reached. Ms. Markov, I believe I have a lead. The Catholic, otherwise known as Connor McCarthy, was recently released from a Montana penitentiary. I suggest we search the system. Guess you are a man of your word after all. On it. We should divide and conquer. You look for word in Belgrade, and I'll check Ravali. Roger. So, what's up? Same old, same old. The steel rats have been muscling in on our territory. I think when they heard Durgan was out of the picture, they might have figured it was a good time to make a move. How hard are they coming? Well, they're bringing in some heavy firepower. A big war party just moved into Juarez. We need to hit them hard and fast and let them know we aren't weaker now than before. Well, let's get on it. Okay, you ready to hit it? Locked and loaded. Follow me. Disengaged by distress signal. This is Randall. Look what wandered into this slaughterhouse. Destination reached. Craft entry. Damn, the area. we've got a couple of destroyers. This is gonna be nasty. It's talking about it. Let's get to work. File inbound. Bet your future in a dizzying array of games of chance. Blackjack, craps, king, and the highest paying. There goes one destroyer. New you share your fort? I'm gonna burn you to dust. <laughs> Missile inbound. Missile inbound. Got you. Blind. Radar impaired. Missile inbound. Ah, 
shit. I'm gonna end you. I'm out. Damn. Missile inbound. I got locked. to make him think twice before nosing around Juarez. And thanks a lot, Juno. I'm gonna wire some credits your way. You got bills to pay, I know. Thanks, Marla. Take care of yourself. Mission complete. Destination reached. Craft inbound. Juno... I just thought you should have a little update. Richter Tronics is off to a hell of a start. The orders are just rolling in. Well, good for you, Richter. Things are going so well that we're running low on materials. If you've got some free time on your hands, I've got another money-making opportunity. You still holding down the bar in Nacogdoches? Well, for now, until Richter Tronics HQ is fully outfitted. Swing on by. I'm buying. All right, Mr. Businessman. We'll see. Juno, my dear. I was wondering if you might be willing to assist me with a little problem. A little problem? Surely nothing dangerous. A bit of investigative work. If I can, I'll drop by Sparks. Thank you, Juno. Greatly appreciated. I'm looking for a guy named Connor McCarthy. Sometimes calls himself the Catholic. You know anybody by that name? You mean the greatest fool in the Montana system. That's the picture that's beginning to emerge, yeah. The moron has barely been out of lockup for a solar day, and he's been charging around blind drunk, talking up a gold ice to anyone who will listen. If you wait another day, you'll know exactly where he is. Right back behind bars. A gold heist? Do you have any idea where? They mine the gold out around the Superior Belt. But it's heavily protected, and he's hardly one for subtlety. Follow the sound of a firefight, and I imagine you can't go wrong. Thanks. Looks like our mutual friend can't go a day without screwing up. We might find him near the superior belt, or at the very least what's left of him. I'll meet you there. Destination reached. Craft inbound. And there he is. Good. If we don't save his sorry ass, there's going to be nothing left to question. Think you're safe. Ah, 
Now you goddamn cops, get off! Sail in now. Oh, Juno Marco. It's been a wee while. And, oh, Mr. Ruth. What a pleasure. And a coincidence. Missile inbound. Radar impaired. for the hand lass. We can share in the wealth together. I'm not in it for the gold, Connor. Ruth here tells me you're full of shit, and we're here to find out how full. Indeed. Oh, what an unkind thing to say, girlie. Impugning my honor and all that. Radar the three impaired. of us are gonna have a little sit down, unless you want us to tie things up right here. Fine, fine. I tell you what. Let's meet up all civilized like on Belgrade, okay? After you, Connor. Be sure you make the appointment, Connor. The devil's got you! Mission complete. Destination reached. Clearance granted. You are now entering an automatic landing zone. There's the little rat. Okay, fine, Jesus, you found me. Arsen your way after me all around the feckin' galaxy. Sounds like the thank yous for saving your ass are over. What the fick do you want, girlie? Can't you just leave me be? I'm hoping for a reason not to kill you now, but my resolve is ebbing. Connor, you swear a whole lot for somebody called the Catholic, and you want me to leave you be? Explain why you lied to me about Brace's murder before I strangle you with that cross around your neck, you little shit. Calm down now. It was just a bit of a spoof. Nobody got hurt or nothing. So hey, I get a bit of cash out of it. It's not worth getting your panties in a twist over. It certainly didn't do anything for my health. My husband is dead, so you need to think about the next words you say really carefully. Well, that's the thing. No, he ain't. You better start making some sense real fast. It's just like I told you, nobody got hurt. Hell, your man was the one that paid me. What? It's like I said, he's alive and well. He paid me good money to point you towards this, uh, this good man here. I see. Where the hell is Brace? I don't know. We ain't exactly best of friends. How'd he contact you in the first place? Tracked me down in Carolina, dropped a load of credits on the table, and hey-ho, there you go. But I don't expect you to find him there. I'm sorry, lass, but I don't have much more to tell you. It's not that I don't appreciate you pulling me arse out of the fire out at Superior and all. I... I gotta think this through. Brace, you son of a bitch. So, what's this little problem you were talking about? It's a bit embarrassing. A high roller appears to have been cheating my casino. He's beating the system, and we haven't been able to ascertain how. 
<laughs> you sure he's just not incredibly lucky? Oh, luck had nothing to do with it. If I gave luck a chance to tip the scales, I'd be out of business. All right, fair enough. So what do you want me to do about it? I want you to find and encourage the individual to reveal the loophole. I intend to close it. So, a shakedown. Well, let's not cast it in a negative light. He's the cheat here. All right, I'll see what I can do. Many thanks, Juno. I'm sending his ship's ID to your pad. His name is Trenton Marsh, a local to Nevada. Destination reached. Trenton Marsh, I've been looking for you. Word is you've been playing dirty. It's time to fess up. Who the hell are you? Guess I'm just Lady Justice today. Resources detected. Sure, right. Piss off, lady. Damn it, they always run. Ah, god damn it. Just what I needed. Let's see, which way did you go? Disengage by craft proximity. No! Don't you worry. This don't be over real quick. Looks like we're in the clear. My, my, a little lost thing. Destination reached. Good as dead. You know. Miss no. Markel, the time has come for me to call in my marker. Sander, I was wondering when you'd pop back up. Indeed. I trust that you'll engage with me sensibly. Maybe trust isn't the word to use. Meet me in the sexton system at the Crow's Nest. We'll continue our discussion there. reached. You 
you can run, but you can't hide. Okay, Trenton, my patience is shot. We're gonna do this the hard way. Exile in now. Right or right, it was one of Orzu's own people. Danvers, you want Danvers. We've been splitting the take. Just, just back off. I swear, it'll never happen again. It better not. Craft inbound. All right, better get that info back to Orzu. Looks like it was an inside job, Orzu. Somebody named Danvers. Danvers, eh? And conveniently missing from the station as well. I'll begin an investigation. Thank you, Juno. I've wired some credits for your trouble. Craft no problem. Inbound. Radar impaired. Greetings, Juno. I wondered if you might be interested in some further employment. Could be. What do you have in mind? Call in and tell me something of a more personal nature. If you're interested, meet me on Hobbs to discuss further. I'll think about it. Thanks, Satchel. <laughs> 